Nickelodeon's Orange Zone. Uh, Nickelodeon's Ozone. <clears throat> Nickelodeon's Ozone. Action. Keep watching Nickelodeon's Orange Zone. Hour one. Nick Arcade. And then, hey dude, Nick's Ozone. Get it together. <laughs> Get ready for the ultimate video challenge as these two teams go head-to-head -head with a maze of electronic obstacles for the right to face one of our game wizards in the video zone. Strap yourselves in. Here comes Nick Arcade. And now, here's your host, a guy who's written different lyrics for all the Nick Arcade music. Here he is, Bill And welcome to Nick Arcade, the ultimate video challenge. I'm here today with Anika of the yellow team and Jennifer of the red team who are about to play the face-off game Crater Rangers. And in this game, you have to steer your ATVs over deadly alien landscapes, avoiding craters and explosions and other pitfalls. Whoever steers their vehicle the furthest in 30 seconds will get 25 points in control of Mikey, our video adventurer for the start of round one. Ladies, in the position. Ready, set, go. All right, good jump right there by the yellow team. Great jump there by the red team. Oh, both of them got knocked off. Right now, the score is tied at 60. All right, yellow team just pulled ahead. Some bumps there. Everybody's bumping and jumping. You have to steer around everything, rocks and mines. Right now, they're down to 10 seconds, and it's 105. We're at 115 to 125. We're down to the last five seconds, and it looks like the winner in Crater Rangers is going to be Red Team pulling it up. playing Jennifer. Hey everyone, let's meet who's playing on today's show. The video jocks for the red team are Jennifer and Christopher. Say yo! <laughs> now Jennifer, the scoop on you is that you've been doing ballet for 10 years. Wow. Now, now, why so long? Have you been in such, you know, one thing? Well, um, it's, I don't know, I really don't plan to do it as a career or anything, but it's really, it keeps me in shape and it's just fun and it's graceful fun to do in front of people. All right, terrific. And your partner there is Christopher. Christopher uh, races BMX bikes. Now, Christopher, that's, that's like great in itself. I mean, <laughs> jumping in, in the mud and stuff. Have you ever won any uh, awards or, or prizes? Um, I won one or two up in New York where I used to live over in Shoreham, Long Island. All right. Well, great. And you do some acting now. But yeah, I do acting now for my school. Cool, man. Hope you had fun here. Hey, your opponents today are Patrick and Anika. Say yo! <laughs> Now, Patrick has been collecting Archie comic books for the past two years. How big is your collection, and, and what, what is the year of the oldest book you have? Well, my collection is about, well, I didn't really keep up to date with it, so it's about 30 comics, maybe 40. Wow. My, my oldest comic is a 1964 Archie joke book. Whoa. And it's the number 80, so. Wow, must be very expensive. Hey, and I tell you what, your partner there helping you out likes to travel a lot. Anika, you like to travel a lot. Where have you been? I've been to Scotland because my mom's from there. Mm -hmm. I've been to Africa because my dad's from there. I've been to Hawaii. I've been a lot of places. Oh, my goodness, boy. I'm glad you traveled here. Everyone, let's wish them luck on today's show. I'm going to travel the rules to you back there. We're going to take Mikey, our video adventurer, and you're going to move him all around the screen in every direction except diagonally. Now, as you do this, you're going to run into our four Ps. Points, puzzles, pop quizzes, and prizes. Be careful, though, because there's an enemy up there, and if you run into him, control gets zipped out to the other team. Now, all questions in round one are worth 25 points, and the team with the highest score at the end of the two rounds will be going into the video zone. That is it for the rules. Andrea, where is Mikey headed today? Strap on your pit helmets because Mikey's exploring the dark volcano jungle. In round one, he'll be checking out the accommodations at the local jungle village. But stay away from the witch doctor or he'll practice some bad medicine on you. Bring Mikey successfully past the goal and you will earn 50 points. Back to you, Phil. Booga booga. Thank you, Andrea. Now, red team, you have the face-off points of 25 and you get control of Mikey. You get to move him first. What direction? Left. Okay, Mikey's going left. Ha! 
pop quiz. All right, here we are at the pop quiz. Hands on your buzzers. The correct answer will get you 25 points in control. Mikey's in the volcano jungle, and here's the question. Which actor is known for portraying Tarzan in a string of movies? Is it A, Johnny Weissmuller, B, Rudy Valentino, or C, Arnold Schwarzenegger? <laughs> yes, red team. Rudy Valentino? Ooh, that is incorrect. Yellow team, do you have uh, maybe a, a, a guess? Um, Tell me, it's not buzzing. Would a? A? A is it. Johnny Weissmuller, yes. <laughs> and now you are on the board. The score is tied at 25, and you get to move Mikey, yellow team. What direction? Down. Mikey's headed down. A point square. All right. We're going to add the points to your score. Pam, and you're up to 50, and you still have control. Move Mikey again. Right. Mikey's going right. Pop quiz. Hands on the buzzers. They knew exactly what to do. Mikey is still in the volcano jungle. Here is your question. Which of these people is a tribe of small people who live in the African jungle? Is it A, Hot and Tot, B, Pygmy, or C, Danny DeVito? <laughs> yes, red team. Pygmies? Pygmies is it, yeah! <laughs> the average pygmy is less than five feet tall. You have the points, you've tied up the score, and you're still in control now. What direction? Down. Okay, Mikey's going down. Hidden camera. Okay, now this is another one of our video puzzles. You know, we've taken our Nick Arcade mini cam around the world and have hidden it in some really strange places. Well, the first thing that can buzz in and tell me where our camera is hidden will get 25 points and control of Mikey. Ready? Let's take a look at the hidden camera. Yes, yellow team. Is it a lunch box? Let's take a look and see. It's a lunchbox, yeah! <laughs> kind of the bat lunchbox. You got the point and you have control. Move Mikey again. Down, please. Mikey's going down. <laughs> Video challenge, I like this part. But we're at the video challenge where you get to add more points to your score and maintain control. Who's going to be playing? Uh, I will. Patrick? Okay, Anika, hang on to the board. Patrick, you get to choose from Act Razor, El Viento, Thunder Spirits, Toki, and Robo Army. What one would you like to play? Robo Army. Robo Army. Head on over to Robo Army. Come on with us. I really like this game. It's very cool. In this sci-fi action game, Maxima and Rocky have to restore peace that the Cyber Army has disrupted. This game has six areas, and today our expert challenge is 1,800 points in area one, the jungle. Now, Anika, you have 75 points, and your opponents have 50. Of your 75, I want you to write down how many you're willing to wager on Patrick meeting or beating our expert challenge in 30 seconds. You have three seconds to write it. Do it now. Doing a little hula thing. She's done. Turn around, Patrick. Ready, set. Go! Right, now that's Patrick, he's the Robo Army. And for every guy he blasts, every robot he socks, he grabs himself a hundred points. And he can pick up things as he's doing now, slamming the two robots with the GP is up to 700 points. He's up to 800 now. Remember, he has to meet or beat 1,800. He's up to 1,000. He is slamming. He's squeezing. All right, he's punching. He can also pick up the, oh, he just got hit. He can pick up the arm and swing it. He's up 1,200. He used a special weapon. 1,000. Oh, man. Patrick, two more robots would have done it for you, but you played a great game. How many points were wagered? 15. All right, we're going to adjust the score and play some more. Head back over. So great playing there. I guess time takes out a little bit. We're going to take the 15 points from your score. You're still ahead with 60, and now red team, you have control of Mikey. You get to move in what direction? I tell you what, I already know what direction. We get to zip Mikey straight to the goal because that sound tells me we're almost out of time for this round. We're in sudden death. Now, hands on your buzzers. I'm going to ask you a question. The correct answer to this question will get you 50 points and the goal for round one. Remember, Mikey is in the volcano jungle. Here is your question. Which of the following is Tarzan best known as? Is it A, Lord of the Apes, B, Lord of the Congo, or C, Lord of the Rings? <laughs> yes, yellow team. Uh, is it A? A, Lord of the Apes is it. Yellow team, you've got the goal. 
and you have the 50 points. Hey, let's just take a look at the board here and see where everything was. Pow, there's everything. There were a couple of prizes. Nobody snagged them, but that is all right, because right now, yellow team has 110. Red team has 50, and when we come back, the points are double. You know what we're going to do. We're going to head to round two. So if I were you, I would cruise back with us. See what happens. This game is close. It can go either way. Check it out on Nick Arcade. Yeah. The Nickelodeon space travel module Slime One has just returned to Earth with some startling findings. Venus has a desolate mountainous terrain covered with what appears to be sea monkeys, yet it has no kids' network. Saturn is made up entirely of crunchy peanuts, chewy caramel, and gooey nougat, but no kids' network. And while there are no life forms visible, Neptune does have one radio station which plays La Bamba all day. Still no kids' network. Based on these findings, we can now say that Nickelodeon is the first kids' network in the entire known universe. Hi, I'm Polly Pocket. <gasps> Check out what's happening in my world. Polly Pocket has to travel with the groom and bride. How? There's a Polly World Park with a roller coaster ride. Polly Pocket, Polly Pocket, Polly Pocket, Polly Pocket. You can order up lunch, drive around in the sun. And now you can get a free Polly and a friend. One pair on specially marked compacts while supplies last. You'll have twice as much fun as Polly Pocket. Polly Pocket compacts, each sold separately from Mattel. This is a world-famous inventor. Can he guess what's new about Cinnamon Toast Crunch? They put it on a stick. No way! So many swirls. They added a hole! I hate to burst this bubble. Any kid can see. Cinnamon Toast Crunch now has cinnamon swirls. For more cinnamon and sugar taste, you can really see. The swirl part of this complete breakfast. See? He's got the idea. Happy, happy, joy, joy, happy, happy, joy, joy. Why are we so happy? Because we're here for round two, and joining me is Patrick of the Yellow Team, Christopher of the Red Team. They're going to be playing Crater Ranger. Now, remember, in this game, you have to maneuver your ATVs over this dangerous alien landscape. You have to avoid craters and explosions and other pitfalls. Whoever drives their vehicle the farthest in 30 seconds will get 50 points and control of Mikey, the video adventurer, for the start of round two. Guys, in the position. Move your rangers. Ready, set, go! Ooh, red team is out. Right now, the score is still pretty close, though. It's at 45, 45. A lot of maneuvering, a lot of driving, steering around everything, steering around astronauts and jumping over rocks. Ooh, red team is off. Right now, we're at 15 seconds, and it's 105 for the 115 for the yellow team. 90. Scores are ticking up. We are down to seven seconds. Getting driving around the octopus, driving around the plants. We're down at the last couple of seconds. Pulling it off is the yellow team. All right. Let's go. Let's play some more. Great steering. Great steering, Patrick. Hey, gang. Yellow team, you got the face off. 50 points added to your score. But hey, Andrea. Tell us where Mikey's headed for round two. Well, Phil, in round two, Mikey's working his way around the base of the active volcano, Mount Blow of Fuse. But there's more than just lava to be careful of. That witch doctor is still hiding somewhere in the bushes. Guide Mikey past the goal, and you will earn 100 points. Take it, Phil. Hey, thank you. I have it, Andrea. Now, gang, remember, the four P's are still up there. Points, puzzles, pop quizzes, and prizes. The witch doctor, you'll want to watch out for him because you'll lose control. Now, all questions in round two are worth 50 points, and the team with the highest score at the end of this round will be going into the video zone. That is it. Now, yellow team, you won the face off. You're up to 160, and you have control. Move Mikey, please. Uh, down, please. Mikey's going down. What was that? Now, this is another one of our video puzzles. Now, we're going to rewind some video of a common household item, and all you have to do is figure out what was that before we trashed it. The first team that can buzz in and tell me what it was before we trashed it will get 50 points and control of Mikey. Let's take a look at what's left of the object, and here is a clue. There's a hidden message in every one. Okay, let's roll it. Oh, gee, yes, yeah, yellow team. Is it a yes. fortune cookie? Oh, let's take a look and see if it's a fortune cookie. The yellow team pulled it off. They pulled it off and went through. Excellent job. Great, great eyes. 
We're going to add the 50 points to your score, and you get to move Mikey again. What direction? Right. Mikey's going right this time. Pop-up a quiz! Pop-up a quiz. I have a question for you in the pop-up a quiz. Hands are on your buzzers. This is for control and 50 points. Remember, Mikey is in the volcano jung jungle. Anopheles is the scientific name for which insect that spreads malaria? Is it A, dragonfly, B, mos mosquito, or C, teetsy? <laughs> yes, yellow teetsy. Is it B, mosquito? B, mosquito is it. Yes. 50 more points added to your score, yellow team. You're up to 260. And guess what? You still have control of the big M, the Mikester. What direction would you like to move? Uh, down, please. Okay, Mikey's going down a little more. Ooh, ooh, the witch doctor got, excuse me, but control now zips over to the red team, and you get to move Mikey this time, red team. Left, please. Mikey's taking a trip to the left. A 50 point square. Woo! Point square. Add that 50 points, you snag some points there. Great with that, and you get to move Mikey again. Down, please. Okay, Mikey's moving down this time. Pop quiz. Here is your question. Hands on buzzers, everyone. Which fruit-eating jungle bird species is the mascot for a po popular breakfast cereal? Is it A, the ostrich, B, toucan, or C, big bird? <laughs> yes, yellow team? Uh, B, toucan. Hey, he follows his nose. He always knows. He's got 50 points, and they're up to 310. You get to move Mikey now. Yellow team, you snag control. Down, please. Mikey's taking another trip down. The video challenge. <laughs> Yellow team, he's been back this way. We're in the jungle, booga, 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 booga. Hi again. Dang, you know what goes on here. I need to find out who's going to be playing. I will. You're going to play? Oh, okay, okay, okay. And you can hang on to the board. Patrick, you get to choose from Act Razor, El Viento, Thunder Spirits, or Toki. Robo Army is out of it. Which one of those four? Uh, Thunder Spirits. Thunder Spirits. Head on over to Thunder Spirits, and you can come on over with us. Now, this is a space shoot 'em up game where you have to pilot the fighter ship Vrax to defend the Commonwealth. This game has eight stages, and today on Thunder Spirits, our experts challenge is 2,500 points in stage one. You have to meet or beat that in 30, 30 seconds. Now, you have 310 points. Your opponents have 100. Of your 310, write down how many you're willing to wager when your partner beating our expert. You have three seconds. Do it now. Another wager. She is done. And I'll tell you, my friend, to turn around here, grab the controller. Ready, set, go. He's flying. All right, he's shooting up everything in his path. Each ship gets him 100 points. Oh, he just got blown up. Basically, you're firing everything as he flies through this cavern. He's, ooh. Okay, he's avoiding being hit. That's really running. He's up to 1,200 points. He has to get 2,500. He's making sure he's not getting hit. Oh, it looks like he was damaged, but he came back with another ship. He's got some shield power happening there. He's up. Ooh, my goodness. It seems like he got blown up and ran into a little problem, but that is okay. Hang on now. Let's see how many points we're wagered. 15, we're just going to deduct that from your score and play some more. Yeah, we're going to play some more. We're going to play some more after we take the points from your score. Yellow team, we're going to take 15 points away, but you still have a decent lead at 295. But red team, you have control of Mikey. What direction would you like to move in? Right, please. Mikey's moving right. Video challenge, red team. Coming to visit me. Put up the hut and chop a squat. How you doing, Red Team? Video challenge. Add points to your score and maintain control. Now, who's going to be playing? I will. Jennifer will be playing. Okay, Christopher, hang on to the board. Jennifer, you get to choose from Act Razor, El Viento. Thunder Spirits is out of it. You can choose Toki and Robo Army is out of it. So you get to choose from those three. Which one? Toki, please. Toki. Head on over to Toki. Christopher, come on over here to Toki with us now. Here is the scoop on Toki. This is an adventure game where you have been turned into a toke, an ape named Toki, and you have to go on this little jungle journey. This game has multiple stages, and today on Toki, our expert challenge is 4,500 points in stage one. 
Now, you have 100 points, Christopher. Your opponents have 295. Write down your wager on whether or not you think Jennifer can beat the expert's challenge. Write it now. She's writing down the stuff. Keep it a secret. Turn around here, Jennifer. Good chance to make up some points. Ready, set, go! Go, Jennifer. She is off. She just picked up some triple firing power. Excellent. All right, she shot a couple of armadillos. She got 200 points for each of those. Grabbing fruit, she's getting points. All right, for everything else she grabs, she picks up 300 points. She knocked away one of the spike holes, another 300. She's done it! Yes, Jennifer! Great plan! Christopher Wagered, a happy face 50. That's the goal to win a just a score. Yeah! <laughs> happy face, written all over the video place. All right, 50 points added to your score, and you get the move, Mikey, again. What direction? Woo. Hey, guess what? I know what direction. Mikey's going straight to the goal. We're running out of time, and we are in sudden death. So I have a question here for you. Everybody, hands on your buzzers. The correct answer will get you 100 points and the goal for round two. Mikey's in the volcano jungle, and here's your question. Which tribe of natives can be found in the rural areas of Australia? Is it A, the Aboriginal, B, the Amazons, or C, the Zulu? <laughs> Yes, yellow team. Uh, A, please. A is correct. Aboriginals, you have got the goal. You have the 100 points. Hey, let's just take a look at the old big TV screen here and see where everything was. Pow, oh, there's everything. Prize, video challenges. But right now, we're looking at yellow team with 395. You are going into the video zone. Red team. Red team, you are making a major comeback. You are great players. Andrea, tell them what they leave with. BK Diamond Cell, the performance shoes with the Diamond Cell diamonds inside and a hologram tag on the outside. When you got BK Diamond Cells on, you're ready for anything. And Hershey's Drink Boxes, introducing an exciting new look and three delicious new flavors. Strawberry, chocolate, marshmallow, and banana split. They're the best thing next to chocolate. Back to you, Phil. Oh, oh here they are right here. The yellow team, they're going through that door into the video zone. There's a wizard waiting for them. So come on back and see what happens. I wouldn't miss it. Are you ready? What about you? Yes, yeah. See you back. Prepare for the next level. Nick Arcade will be back after this. It's a big couch. Someone's got to sit in it. Get your butt on the big orange couch and snick this Saturday on Nickelodeon. From Adamu Mesa, a new legend is born. Heroes with good and hives and horns. Wild West Cowboys! Sheriff Carol Bull was whipping up a scheme and his cowboy's game was looking real mean. But Moo Montana's always ready for trouble and he stopped that sheriff with his quick draw double. Wild West Cowboys! Colorado roped him as a matter of course. Geronimo rode the iron horse. With cannon blades and he showed him who's best. The good guys win. That's, That's the cold of the west. West. Wild West Cowboys! Wild West Cowboys come with everything you see here. Figures and iron horse each sold separately. It seems no matter how much you want a crisp, delicious Eggo waffle, there's always someone who wants a little more. Delicious Eggo Waffles, part of the nutritious breakfast. Isn't technology wonderful? Hershey's Drink Box now comes in chocolate marshmallow, strawberry, and banana split. Hershey's new flavored drink. The best things next to chocolate. You are in the Ozone. And now back to Nick Arcade. We are back, and these two are ready to do battle with Scorcia. Now, here's your challenge. Player one has to collect three bunches of bananas sitting high in the jungle tree. Touch the toucans, snakes, piranhas, and coconut thorn monkeys, and they will all take your power away. Go under the waterfall, or touch the golden idol, and a rope will appear to help you over it. Collect all three bananas, and here's Andrea to tell you what you get. Hang tin clothes for kids. The original California classics everybody will want to be seen in. They're cool and comfortable. Hang out in Hang Ten. Now, player number two will be on an enchanted flight to recover three magic rings. 
Hit the magic lamp to restore power, but avoid the genie, royal guard, gate traps, cobras, and guard dogs. Also, watch out for the sword swinging guard and baby dragon. Collect all three rings, and here's Andrea to tell you what you'll get. The Vivitar 320C Compact Autofocus Camera with built-in power zoom lens. Beautiful 35mm pictures from Scenic to Portrait from Vivitar. Now, with the time left, you'll belt take on Scorcia in the wizard level. Catch three floating orbs while avoiding dangerous fireballs and creatures. Touch the spinning hourglass and you'll freeze everything for five seconds. Beat Scorcia by catching all three orbs and you will win today's grand prize. Capture all the family fun and festivities with this full-size Zenith camcorder. With 8 to 1 power zoom that makes it easier than ever to create professional looking home videos. Good luck in the video zone. Hey, get in there and do battle with Scorcia. Go, go, go. Yes, she's waiting. All right. A lot of jumping and ducking is going to be done, but I feel good about these two. They're in position, ready, and go! Okay, finally, bam, the first bunch has been gotten. Second bunch all the way, one power unit down, down two power units, okay? The two bunches of bananas, there's the rope. The big swing's about to happen. Whoa, whoa, a little bit fast over the water. Bam, all three, all right. We are started now. The Enchanted Flight on the way, Anika's flying at 40 seconds. Down. One power unit gone, bam, but there's one ring. All right, the genie tried to zap at 34 seconds, missed, sure. and another ring was captured, down to three units of power. Up, over, bam, got the power back full, and the third ring is gotten at 26 seconds. They're going to do battle with Portia. Start has to be hit. Start has been hit. All right, we have 20 seconds now. One orb has been gotten. 18 seconds. Let's get some moving, gang. Let's get some moving, gang. We're down to 13. All right, the hourglass has been hit. Let's move. Let's go get it, gang. We're down to seven seconds. Oh, my goodness. Ran out of power. We are getting down to the last second. Oh, my goodness. Hey, listen. We're out of time. They ran a great run. We'll see you next time on Nick Arcade. See you. Bye. Yeah. here, and I've never really liked horses. I prefer horsepower that's generated by a fuel-injected 2.2-liter overhead cam engine. The point is that, in my opinion, the best way to go to a dude ranch is by staying right where you are and watching Hey Dude, next. This Valentine's Day, celebrate with 14 of Nickelodeon's mushiest shows. You look as lovely as the Hoover Dam today, Ellen. It's Nickelodeon's Valentine's Day Mush Fest. This Sunday, starting at 2-1 Central, only on Nickelodeon. Fun fishing? You bet. Hey guys, breakfast! Let's go, Grandpa. You got it. Come on, I want my cow's corn pops. Stay calm. Is there a problem? Looks like we may have to catch our breakfast. <laughs> ha ha, this isn't funny. Bull likes sweet popcorn, there's never enough. And I'm stuck in the middle of Lake Okama joke, and everyone's eating pops except me! Kellogg's corn pops is part of this complete breakfast. I gotta have my pops. New Teddy Graham's Rockin' Bears Got new things to savor We love to munch It's time to rock and bears And vanilla and chocolate too It's Rockin' James It's just for you Four new Rockin' Shapes On tour for a limited time only You can run But you can't hide Because the Double Dare Live Tour is coming On February 13th In Cleveland, Ohio At Richfield Coliseum On February 14th In Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania At Palumbo Center on February 15th in Buffalo, New York at Kleinhans Music Theater. Nickelodeon is coming to your city and it won't be pretty. Reach out and find someone. The Double Dare Live Tour is brought to you by the first kids network, Nickelodeon. Keep watching yeah. Nickelodeon's Orange Zone. Hour one. Hey, dude. Then what would you do? Nick's O-Zone. Get it together. <laughs> 